Next is the upper airway structure, which is the paranasal sinuses. So the paranasal sinuses are composed of four mucosal lined spaces found within their respective bones. They are frontal sinus, behind ethmoidal sinus, sphenoidal sinus, on either side maxillary sinus. So let us talk about the frontal sinus above. The frontal sinus located in the frontal bone along the midline superior to the orbital openings. And the frontal sinus drains into ethmoidal infundibulum via frontonasal duct which opens into the nasal cavity through the semilunar hiatus. Annexed is the ethmoidal sinus located in the ethmoid bone between the superior and middle nasal concave composed of 8 to 10 air filled cells and the important clinical correlate over here is the pain of ethmoidal sinusitis is what creates the sensation of the pain behind the eyes and the sphenoidal sinus is located in the body of the sphenoid bone and drains into the spheno-ethmoidal rusus. And at last is the maxillary sinus which are larger located in the maxillary bone and here the floor is formed by the alveolar process of the maxilla and it is responsible for the toothache associated with maxillary sinusitis. This sinus drains into the nasal cavity via the semilunar hiatus because this opening is found superiorly within the sinus and the maxillary sinus is particularly prone to infection when compared to that of other sinuses. So this is what you need to know about the paranasal sinuses and applied physiology.